All right, it will likely be decades before self-driving cars dominate our roadways. But for local transportation experts, it's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when. 41 Action News reporter Jade DeGood spent time with Kansas City Scout to talk about preparing for the future. Kansas City Scout manager Randy Johnson gets a hands-on feel for the future of automotives. It's a great way for us to have a great understanding of the technology that is out there and able to really understand how does a Tesla and other vehicles see around them, which will help us in the future engineer the road infrastructure needed for this technology that's coming very rapidly. Tesla is just one of several companies making large strides when it comes to driverless cars. Just think of the safety. You know, we could reduce crashes 90 to 95 percent because that is what human error involvement is in crashes. Local transportation departments like KC Scout are already looking ahead to what autonomous or even semi autonomous cars will mean for Kansas City roads. Because it's so early, right now, it's a lot of learning and communication of what to do. But Scout is very innovative and creative, and we want to make sure we are on the forefront and ready for when anything changes. So what might we see as more vehicles become connected to the technology around them like never before? The thing may be is what they call vehicle to infrastructure, so the cars can talk to our traffic signals. And so when a car is going down the highway, these cars will, it will know when the light will turn green, yellow, or red. So that kind of gives advantage to reducing crashes. Johnson says that will also help with traffic flow. The traffic lights will be able to know how many cars are in an area and adjust its signals to help move traffic more efficiently. Those technologies are coming, uh, not out there just yet, but we are preparing ourselves to be there when that when opportunity arises.